thank you. Yeah, for a second I thought these were just uh, tramplers in those woods. But um, of course not. That would be too easy. Instead they were... Instead they were uh, those... those uh, I will remember in a second what they were. Behemoths, yes, that's the one. Hmm. Not great vision on this guy. All right, let's do this for Hexes now. There we go. You are free now, my friend. So, staring that one robot down rather fiercely. Okay, no, okay, not gonna start anything. That's fine. No need to be... No need to get violent with them. Okay, so, long legs there. And its huge friends are... Somewhere. I don't actually see them now. Oh, there you are. Behemoth, yeah. Rhino bots. Ugh. Too much for me. Too much for me. And as far as I can tell, I think if I try to fight that long leg, these things will get alerted. Although I do see here's like this. I wonder if this is some kind of trap I could knock down on those things. I don't know. I'll just put those there, like so. Not that they're particularly difficult to notice, <laughs> of course, being that they are the size of a... Uh, size of a big old, like, double-decker bus. Another long leg. Another campfire. Guess I could try sneaking over to it. Yeah, it's actually... It's towards the ruins anyway, so let's go. And it looks like for the time being it's safe, so... Man, I really feel like I'm shirking my machine hunting duties here a little bit, but like every encounter, it's so bloody difficult. Oh god, this robot's coming right this way. Never mind, I was gonna go pick up the rabbit, but nope. You can have it. You can have it, my birdie friend. Okay, Voice on the radio did mention that there would be uh, Eclipse people here, and this is a built thing. So, we gotta be careful. Charger. Do I remember? Have we met Chargers yet? No, we haven't. Ah, I see. Bighorn sheep. Okay. These herd machines will actively pursue an attack in numbers. Mm, fire onto the blaze canister. Very good. Man, they have they have chainsaws on their horns. Some real Warhammer character design here. Oh, where did you all come from? Good heavens! Let's try going this way instead. Oh, oh, look—a friendly, friendly salesperson. Okay, you have found a strange place to do uh, practice your um, trade, sir or ma'am, but. I'm not going to complain. Oh yeah, now let's get a look at these outfits. Ooh, I could get the Karja Blazon. Cool. Um, what was the... I swear something was Ravagers. What was Ravagers? It's the Osoram Arrow. That's a really cool outfit too. Oh no, should I take the Blazon right now or... Save for this. This looks super cool, but... Uh, I think... I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna play the... I'm, I'm, I'm gonna play the long game. Uh, so I would like that, but I'm, I'm gonna let that be for now. I think... Although I will do some shopping for some health potions here, so... This is gonna eat up my... 
shards, yeah. Let's just get a third one of these. Okay. Well, maybe I'll have money for the Osaram suit. Like, I'll, I'll, I'll stick with this costume for a little longer. What do you think's the over-under on killing one of these things with a single shot? I could have overridden it. Oh, okay. It's gonna turn right this way, isn't it? Not quite. Hmm. Should I give these fellas an overriding? I'll do it to the last one. Du, 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 du. That was uh, very close. More over there, but I'll instead... I'll override this fella. Come on. I could use a big horn on my team. Welcome to the team. Oh, cool, you can, you can ride them. That's kind of fun. I'm not a crazy fan of riding in this game, as I've mentioned. More about the sneaky sneaks, so... Also, wow, the weather sure became something all of a sudden, didn't it? Like, y y yikes. It's like level 27 corrupted zone there. <laughs> this is, that's crazy. Oh, I do not fancy my chances, no. I'm not crazy, right? This was like, yeah, level 14. Like, this should be very much doable, but uh, the robot wildlife is giving me a run for my money. Right, so this is Maker's End, right? Goodness. Wow, that's ominous. This is... Very, very spooky. Ooh, oh, something purple. Oh, oh, right, that's the actual thing we're looking for. Very good. Nice, 65 metal shards, a handling coil, a rope caster. We, we, do, we do, do, do have that already. This handling coil, can we put it on our rope caster? Or maybe on our war bow, yes. Damn. Karja Warbo is looking scary now. Because I want you to succeed. Good hunting. We'll talk later. Wait. Damn him. Not a great conversationalist. But let's go find out what's going on in this besotten place. A couple of vessels to find as well. We'll keep our eyes open for that. Yep, yep, that's a, that's a ruin of the old world, that's for sure. Are, seriously now? Watchers. Acting as guards. Right, the whole eclipse the business. I almost forgot, but yeah, of course. Here they are for us to deal with. Hey, a rat! Can we... Do you get anything from rats? Apparently not. I'm pretty sure I... Oh, never mind. I did. Okay, cool. Let's see. What do you get from a rat? Tiny meat. Look, it's a tiny. Jeez, no way in but the front door. I could try walking around the building, but... Uh, yeah. Thankfully, these weather conditions are in my favor if I want to stealth my way in, so... Let's see how it goes, shall we? Blurg. And will this guy look this way? Not by the looks of it. Nobody else over here. Ooh! Somebody over there. Ah, oh, they're digging up more robots here for their... ...twisted plans. I understand. Up 
No, it's your imagination. I really didn't think he'd be looking up here, but he in fact was. Gosh darn it. At least we can put this robot out of commission. I think there's a guy right underneath there, yeah. Oh no, it's, a, it's another robot. Okay. Sneaking on up here. Put another robot out of commission, and... Oh shit, guy's running up here. Okay. Yeah, you guys were imagining everything. It's fine. There's nothing up here. Oh, jeez. I'd say that actually went better than most of my stealth attempts in enemy camps in games like these. There's a guy right there. Wow. Jesus. I almost walked into that guy's lap. Uh oh, corruptor. They're not making my life easy, that's for sure. Okay, where did that one guy go? Is he now he's now down there? Cultist Punisher. I'm thinking I should maybe take him out if he comes back up here, you know. Just to ensure that he won't be coming behind me. We'll see if he walks back up here. Yeah, some kind of robot parts there. I guess, yeah, this place... Yeah, it's, it's a ruin, so it makes sense to come check for gear here, I suppose. Okay, now I don't think that robot will notice me if I take this guy out from here. Yeah. Lucky. Yep, shards. Okay, let's go. Nah, the corruptor is right that way. That's the problem. Yeah, wow, it's, it's right in my path. That, uh, don't make jumps. You're making noise, Aloy. Oh, no. Let's mark that guy. Anyone I haven't marked? Wow, that guy's kind of alerted somehow all the way over there. I don't know why. All right. Wait for that robot to move there. Okay. Another leg of the journey, that's fine. Now, I'm thinking I need to take out this watcher here. A corruptor. That might prove a challenge. I'm not even sure where I'm supposed to be going next. Like, it's pointing me towards a... Maybe, oh, maybe that path there? Yeah, it looks like it's wrapping around over there, so... First, just in case, as a little security, let's shut this machine down. Ooh. No, of course not. That That's crazy talk. <laughs> Where would you get the idea that there's somebody here? <laughs> you silly man. Uh, okay, let's check our treasure box. An outfit weave. Ooh. So we have resist melee attacks. Uh, okay, but the corruption one might be good. God, it's looking right this way. Let's back up. I'm gonna try and stealth past this corruptor. Just gotta hope that it turns to look that away at some point. Because if I get in a fight with this thing, this whole camp here is gonna come after me, so it's not gonna be just me v the corruptor. Per no! Just... No, you're, out there. you're wrong! <laughs> That'll probably convince him. Okay, it looks like I need to kind of like 
follow the flow of this corruptor once uh, it starts walking back, if you catch my vibe. So, like, right now... Oh, God, I... I don't even have a time to open that box because this... This is a dead end! This is a freaking dead end! In more ways than one. Bloody hell, where am I supposed to go? So how did you fight these things? I, I, oh, every time I have to go to these damn notebooks to be like, how did you do these again? So this guy, Corruptor. He's got a grenade launcher, tear, tear, fire, fire to the body. You want to try that again? Oh, grenade launcher time, huh? Well, that did like nothing to it. That, uh... That rope I put there. Yeah, this guy's in trouble. Yeah, okay, there we go. Yeah, camp is a little going a little wild here. Uh, I'm stuck on something. What the? What the heck was that? Oh, jeez. Now the whole camp is here. Yeah, this is insanity now, huh? Um, hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, wish, wish weapon wheels were a little easier to set up than they currently are, but I guess that's on me for not prepping earlier. Oh my god, fine. I... I don't know. There was like... So many freaking... Oh my god. Okay, but okay, so we know we don't need to actually go to that dead end then. Oh, you make me start all the way back here. Oh my god. Why would you... Game, why would you do this to me? Fine. Corrupted watchers. Acting as guards. You hear something weird, robot? Why don't you come take a closer look? Cooperating. One happy family. Oh, it's doing such a good job stealthing, and then... Um, wow, all the way back here, okay. So there really aren't any other checkpoints except uh, the, the campfires. So it goes, I guess. Eclipse, just like you said. Okay, so, if I remember correctly how I did this the first time... When that guy's over there, I think it's okay to kill this guy now. Yep, he didn't notice anything. Now let's mark some of these folks. Oh, he has not turned around. That's not good. Someone noticed me when I snuck up over here on my first go. But now that guy is down there, so now this might actually be safe to go across. I'm hoping so. Fingers crossed. Actually, I'm super glad I didn't change costumes now, because I realized this is the stealth suit. <laughs> and like, yeah. I'm getting my ass stealth, that's for sure. 
Don't really need to stealth kill this guy anymore, but... Yeah, I probably won't. I'll just get draw undue attention from down there, so... I'm just gonna let that be. Now, where's the one guy? This guy's right here. Let's clean him up quick-like. Yep. Down you go! A resource supply box, eh? Let's have a look what's in there. Metal shards, a vessel, and a ridge wood. Sure. Also, let's make some fire arrows. Now that we have all these uh, blaze canisters. Keep our supplies up. And let's... Yeah, why don't I equip the sling instead of the war bow? Hmm... No, I... It's a rope caster. I need to sell that off, honestly. I don't need two of them. Blast sling. Let's just set that up. Okay. So let's think this one through now. It's not getting any warmer out here. Someone apparently heard me. Crazy enough. Yeah, I'm not sure which direction I'm supposed to go to now. So that was a dead end where I tried to run away from that uh, corruptor. Are you... No way. No way can he spot me from that far away. No. Maybe I'm supposed to climb up there, maybe? Because you can see there's, you can climb up there and there's a torch burning there. That might be the ticket. Holy moly. Let's see if I can get in these bushes real quick. That might prove a challenge. Where did this guy come from? I don't care. I'm gonna finish him off real quick. There we go. Hey, more resources. Uh, no, no. There we go. Hey, fatty meat. Can we make some more potions now? I hope so. Uh, we can make some uh, health boost potions. Yeah. This while I can. I'll probably have to use one of those soon. <laughs> okay, so... I think now's my chance. Hmm. Not seeing anything up here, so this might have been... Wrong place to go after all, but game really wants me to go over there where that corruptor is hanging out. But I didn't see any. Maybe there was something to climb there or something. I'll I'll have to have another look. But first, I'm gonna deal with this guy, of course. Wait, what was that? Good question. Why don't you come closer and take a look? Clean. Dredger. Yeah, game really wants me to go that way, so... Silent Strike on the Corruptor. I wonder if I can one-hit kill him. I suspect not. Oh, come off it, you giant robot. There's nothing to find here. There, a thing to climb on, I think. Okay, 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 I missed this on my first go-through. Okay, so we could have avoided a whole lot of hassle if I just spotted that. Fair. I don't like that noise at all. Speaking of... 
Deathbringer. Oh no. You mean that thing that uh, Olin mentioned would be way worse than a Corruptor? An unearthed ancient weapon platform built to deliver overwhelming force, prone to overheating. Yeah, that's a uh, that's some proper. Yeah, look at this thing. <laughs> Amazing. Oh my goodness. So I'm even. I'm not even clear where this repeater cannon is on this thing. But okie dokie, we gotta watch out for that. Fire and shock are its weaknesses. It's got big cooling rods that come up when it overheats. Okay. Big old core. Flamethrowers, yikes, grenade, good lord. A straight up gun turret in the middle, very good. Swarm launcher, yikes! This is gonna be something, isn't it? Oh boy. Well, first, let's reward ourselves with an ancient vessel. Yay! Thunderheads, a cracked and battered vessel once dear to the old ones, bears the legend Rocky Mountain Thunderheads. Sets of ancient vessels can be traded in Meridian for valuable rewards. Cool. Oh man, I would, uh, hmm, this is annoying because we're at the end of episode basically at this point. I would really like another, you know, save checkpoint at this point if we're going to be going into an encounter. with this thing, but... Say la vie, I guess. Oh my... Good lord, look at this thing! I mean, it's awesome, but... I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do if I have to fight that thing. Kill the cultists and the Deathbringer. Now the weird thing is, Deathbringer's only level 14. I'm pretty sure the Corruptor was a higher level. I don't understand how the enemy levels in this game work. I'm, I'm very unclear. Where's that guy up there? Do not know, but uh, yeah, uh, next time I don't, I really don't know. I'm gonna try and thin the enemies around it first, and then boogie against the Deathbringer. That's gonna be the plan. But I think I will have to do it next time because this is gonna be a very involved thing. Huh? This robot's not too curious, but. I can still take him out. Oh wow, all these cultists are just hanging out on the ground. Hold on. Uh... Oh wait, that thing took tons of damage. Ah! Well, I guess we're in it now. Oh my god, we are no longer in it. Okay, so, uh, yeah, I was kind of like, I just want to see how that goes. And wow, that Deathbringer actually took a ton of damage because it doesn't like fire, yeah. So I, oh, that's very kind of them to put us right here, okay. That's very, that's nice, even though, even though, like, there's no save point here. They put a checkpoint here. I wonder if, um, when I come back to the game next time, next session, do I start here? Or will I be forced to do that stealth again through the cultist camp? Uh, I guess we'll find out. Uh, well, you won't, you won't have to watch that. Don't worry, guys. I'll, I'll cut right to this part, whatever happens, but uh, that remains to be seen. Okay, yeah, I guess original plan is how it's going to have to go. I'm going to try to thin the, the robots, the, the, the watchers first, I guess, and then figure out how I beat the Deathbringer. Okay, yeah, no problem, no problem. It's...
It's <laughs> no big deal. I can take that thing. <laughs> See you all then, everybody. Bye-bye.